Today is Wednesday. It's time for our weekly trip to the new zoo. Neil Anderson joins us now live from Suamico. Hi, Neil. Hey, good morning. While we're hanging out with the pelicans, we're inside our North American aviary, and we just ended up uh, uh, adding a new pelican, Maury, who was found on uh, Lake Butamore, and he actually had uh, a broken wing, so he's not going to be able to be released back to the wild, so he has joined Durango, who also had a foot problem uh, because he was caught in fishing line out in Green Bay, so they're both birds that are going to have to make a living now, you know, in a captive environment, and we've got a perfect place for them uh, in here in our North American aviary. But we want to show you something is, you know, when you want to, when you're going to visit a zoo, I mean, we always talk about visiting a zoo at different times of the year because you're going to see different things. Animals are different. You know, the the birds here, everything's in breeding season. Now I want to show you the the differences with these pelicans. Now take a look at Durango. Okay, he's the one on the right. Now there's a few things that's different with him than Maury. Now Maury's a younger bird, but Maury isn't in breeding plumage. Now take a look at his bill on Durango. You see how brightly colored it is compared to the other one? And, and in addition to that, you see that crest that's on the top of the bill? That grows during breeding season, and believe it or not, it falls off after breeding season. Mm. So it's only there, it goes about, it's about a third of the way up the bill. And then you can also take a look, you'll see around by his eye, you know, it'll be, uh, there'll be a large swelling area and that'll become brightly colored. Uh, that's another uh, difference that you know they're in, in the breeding season. And also when you look at Durango, he's got a little yellowish hue to him. And that color is only there during the breeding season. Now, as soon as they, you know, lay the eggs, uh, what happens then is, like I said, that crest will fall off. Uh, then the coloration, once he does uh, molt out into an eclipse of plumage, he'll look very similar to Maury over there. So it's a little bit different. You know, and here's another thing, you know, when you look at these guys, you know, how big are they? Well, they're, you know, they're probably about, you know, 15 pounds. They're about a little over four feet in length. But get a load of this. They have the second longest wingspan of all North American birds, mm. only second to the California mm -hmm. condor. Their wingspan is 10 feet wide. Wow. That's impressive. And you would never know it looking at these guys. Right. No, not really. But they're incredible birds. They really are. Well, Neil, thank you very much. We'll talk with you again next hour, okay? Hey, there, hey sounds us. good. Oh, yeah.